Hello, Lenovo Social here, and we're with Nina Samuel of Lenovo. How are you, Nina? Doing great, Gavin. How are you? Good. We're standing significantly in the uh, the space tunnel uh, here at CES, and uh, this is reflecting uh, the history that ThinkPad has had in space uh, uh, up on the uh, International Space Station, on the Space Shuttle, uh, multiple affiliations there. Uh, the rugged ThinkPad can get blasted off into space. But we're also here to talk with you, Ninas, today about the YouTube Space Lab uh, contest and program that's been going on. Can you tell people about that? Sure, excited to. Um, what a lot of people don't know is that uh, ThinkPads are the only notebooks allowed on the International Space Station. They're the only ones certified today in space. Uh, they're used widely by NASA, so space is in our heritage at ThinkPad uh, and at Lenovo. So, um, and because of that, we got in uh, this program called Space Lab with Google and YouTube. And it's a program that basically lets uh, students 14 to 18 around the world submit experiment ideas to be conducted on the International Space Station. So we had thousands of student teams from around the world submit experiments, and we have an amazing panel of judges, including Stephen Hawking and na astronauts from around the world who are judging those experiments right now. Uh, so we're going to pick 60 finalists from around the world, uh, and we're going to be showing that um, on youtube.com slash space lab. And voting is going to be available for people to vote on their favorite experiments and their favorite student teams. And once we pick the winners, that's going to be when it gets really interesting. We're going to uh, let the winning teams uh, take zero gravity flights uh, out of Washington, D.C. this year. And the, the winners are going to be sent to Russia to be the youngest people ever to have space flight training. And it doesn't end there. Uh, we're also going to shoot the winning experiments up on a rocket to the International Space Station for the cosmonauts and astronauts on the space station to conduct live on the world's largest live stream from space. And this is all going on this year, 2012, yes? Yes, all this year. So over the next uh, year, you're going to see some great stuff, from seeing the winners to seeing the actual space broadcasts of the experiments being conducted. And it just really shows that uh, we have a passion for technology and innovation and encouraging students to be creative and uh, get out there and do something unique. Well, it sounds fantastic. Thanks for telling us about it, Ninnis. Thank you.